Hi, it's Peter Elbing once again. And in this video, we'd like to show you some of the functional features of DFlow. So the overhead sensor allows us to create a whole new means of identifying and controlling how people go through the gate. The higher level of tracking precision allows us to follow within the gated area two, three, four, even five simultaneous users, as you can see here. Okay, This higher tracking precision allows us also to deal with the normally open gate that closes only for the unauthorized user. So as an authorized user in blue comes into the gate followed by an unauthorized user, the door will close because there's an unauthorized user in the gate. Now as Mario goes through, a Dielson in red cannot pass through. And it's this very strong feature of control which makes DFlow very, very unique. And speaking of opening and closing doors, you'll notice that we have a server control system of controlling the doors, which is based on the position of the unauthorized user, his speed at that position, and his direction of movement. So as a deal zone approaches the door, the doors close, faster or slower, and as he moves away, he's less of a threat, the doors will open. We also have a very interesting feature, which is to control, to identify the different user groups in a site. So for example, in a school application, we can have students in white, you can see the following light, professors in blue, parents in green, and school staff in pink. This brings an added layer of security to the whole uh, system. You'll also notice that the D-Flow is actually a wider gate. And we're actually suggesting at Digicon that all D-Flow gates be wide. And this allows for two very interesting features. One is that a handicapped user can now select any one of the gates that are available. And the second is it makes for a much more comfortable passage through all of the gates. So we have more inclusiveness and more comfort for all users. Wider gates also allow us to have what we call true simultaneous bidirectionality. So you can see that as we come through the gate, two people can pass comfortably. And this allows us to have faster flows. And we've actually made tests where we can have average flows of 35 users per minute with sustainable peaks of 40. So this is D-Flow. And you'll be able to see in the other videos on the site um, a lot of these features in more detail. Thank you very much for your attention.